Hey everybody, I'm Nasty Mold, and there was a huge update in Sky, so we're gonna go over some of the new stuff in the game. Lots of stuff throughout all the realms has changed. Lots of very important game features have been fixed, such as music, Eye of Eden, and we also have some new shared spaces and new events coming. So first up, I'm gonna show the new shared spaces starting in Daylight Prairie. This one is just directly to our left here. And if you're not certain what shared spaces are, they're basically places you can create, placing down props and items you've collected to hang out with your friends. And you can unlock shared spaces by finishing the assembly quests in the treehouse. So any props you own, you can place down. Ta-da! And then you can actually save it and project it for everyone else to play with. I do think this shared space is one of the best locations so far because so many people just hang out in the Daily Prairie social space. So it's a great area. We have a second shared space added though, and this one is also pretty exciting. This shared space is in the recording area of the office. So we have the green screen here. If we sit down, we can place all of our stuff in that green screen area. So it'll make making scenes and unique recordings a lot easier. You can see where those sparkles are is where we can place items. So once we go into this green box, we'll be able to place our props. So a much more creative person than I can set up a pretty amazing scene and I'm excited to see what people will create using this. It's really cool. Something very integral to a lot of players' gameplay has been fixed as well. Pressing the notes has finally been fixed now when you tap in between a note, it doesn't just play nothing, and you won't screw up as much while you're playing your music. I know a lot of friends I have have been really looking forward to this update because at the moment they find playing music impossible. For me, I don't really play much music, but it is very good that this is finally fixed. The shop tricks have been totally patched. They don't do anything anymore, so if you open this, you are gonna lose your winged light, unfortunately. Bah! It's a shame, but I think we all have to learn to play the game the way it was designed to be played, so... No more exploits, only true gameplay. Oh, why is it up there? How am I gonna get that? That's not fair. True gameplay sucks. If you're playing on iOS and some Android versions, you can either swipe down and show the notification center, or swipe up and dock your game. And wait until the Krill's red light goes away. Once you go back to the game, you should stay safe. Ta-da! He's gone. Days of Summer will be coming very, very soon, from August 12th to 25th. It will be bringing an array of brand new cosmetics and some in-app purchases. This is just a little demo. I'll have a full video explaining the entire event coming soon. Look forward to lots of ways to earn new wax and lots of ways to play with your friends. Our next event after that will be the Days of Summer Lights. This is a returning event that will bring us a lantern and a very, very, very cute accessory on our head. This will be coming from September 20th to October 3rd, which means that the Halloween event is not far behind this one. We are already halfway through the season of The Little Prince, which is crazy, this season has gone so fast. However, that means our first round of in-app purchases, The Little Prince Fox and The Little Prince Scarf Cape are leaving August 30th. But don't worry, they'll be replaced by some cool new items. Starting August 30th to September 19th, we'll have The Little Prince Asteroid Jacket available as an in-app purchase for $24.99 USD once we complete the seventh quest. And we can also buy these amazing sword pants for 200 candles. It's a bit early to think about, but the next season pre-order will be starting September 21st. That is weirdly soon. By that point, the season of the Little Prince will have ended, and we can collect the pre-order bonuses such as extra candles. If you want to see more about the season, you can check out a video below where I speculate what might happen. Starting next traveling spirit, they will start to bring props as well as their seasonal items. So here's some examples of some of the props they might bring. We have a big pipe. You can put this in your shared space if you'd like. Or you can just sit in it in home. 
This is meant to be exciting for veteran players who already have all of these cosmetics and the traveling spirits don't really bring much for them. Now they'll bring some cute chairs and props. Now while standing there and doing emotes, we will no longer be bothered by that annoying bug where you will stretch in between your emote. Unless of course you are doing the stretch emote, in which case you're doing just fine. Go you! The winged light has been adjusted on the back of this cape so it all fits onto the lighter purple area. It looks pretty good. Finally, at meditation shrines, we can actually go through and push the arrows to go through all the notes. We can also like them all easily. I'm glad this is fixed because I was not liking notes. I'm really sorry, it just took way too much time and it was annoying. The actual patch note for this one is made icon to display text for message candles and boats easier to select. But I just placed a boat and it fell through the water and I was very sad. That is all. They fixed a lot of clipping with the cosmetics and it is now amazing, especially when wearing accessories on top of hair. Now most hairstyles can support wearing this accessory, especially like the afro, like the afro used to be just it would eat the accessory. So this is awesome and my new favorite thing is to wear a hat on a hat. It always looks hilarious, especially my favorite, the hat on the gat. There we go, my absolute favorite. This is yet another amazing update. The audio levels now slide in the settings. You can now choose your exact volume for music, sound effects, and musical instruments. I'm recording this on my iPad, so it is the worst way for me to possibly show you, but now when you open spirit trees, they will show from the bottom again. Not that annoying bug where you open your friendship tree and it goes to the very top or the middle. It'll start from the bottom. Controllers will now support rolls and spins, so have fun barrel rolling around the sky and doing lots of flips. Whee! Oh, the Eye of Eden. For the past month, it has been an absolute hellscape. You weren't able to run, jump, and now you finally can. Back to easy mode Eden. Finally, we can piggyback our friends again and go into glide mode. Before this update, if you went to glide mode, you would just drop them and it was really sad. You can also do piggy stacks again, so piggyback your friends. There is an improved animation for jumping off of your friend's shoulders. Wow, look at her. That wasn't buggy at all. Now when you have a prop on your back and you place it, the prop will disappear. There will still be a little shadow on your back for now, and this doesn't work with every prop, but I think it's a very cute new feature. My logs are back. Now when jumping on a hammock, AFK will not affect you. Previously, once you went AFK, your character would originally sit up, but now they stay laying down, looking so, so cute. Good night, little buddy. Have a good rest. Now while laying on your hammock, you can no longer snoop on people's conversations, and that goes for any other chair. An unfortunate update, but no one wants to be a sneaky peeky. Now in shared spaces, props are a lot more vibrant and colorful. They look really, really good. This is not my shared space, this is someone else's, and you can finally see colors on objects. Not all of them, of course, but it's a great improvement. Look, you can see it on everything. It's so nice. It makes it a lot more alive. Okay, and that was all of the major changes in this update. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. I hope you found this helpful. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mwah, 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 mwah. Bye-bye.